Brian Mueller here to check out a D5 semifinal matchup between 6 seed Houston and 2 seed Linden Monday afternoon. First game of the best of three. Both offenses got at it early. Top one, Paul Wagner laces a hit to right. That brings in JC Lupercio, and the Huskies are up one to nothing. They get another run on an air, then Jacob Yarborough drives it to right. Deep enough to score Wagner, who comes sliding in hard, three to nothing Houston. The Lions get two back in their frame on a couple sack flies. Then with two on in the third, Cruz Herrera does his job, brings in the tying run with the ground ball to the right side, and it's a new ball game. Third inning now, and it's the other Herrera doing more damage. Alex Herrera pounds this pitch to left center, and out of here, a two-run shot, and the Lions have the lead 5-3. to three. That is still the score in the fifth when Carlos Guizar lines it to right. In comes Wagner, and the Huskies are down just a run. Then, later in the inning, there are two on for Max Mankins and Houston. We have liftoff. This one way back and gone. A three-run shot for the freshman. And the Huskies take back the lead 7-5. to five. Next inning, two on again for the Huskies. And Houston, uh, we have a problem because we need to launch again. This time it's Yarborough. He goes yard. Another three-run homer for the Huskies, 10-5. to five. But the line shows some life. Bottom six, JT Cox gets a base hit to shallow left. A run comes in, and it's 10-6. Then it's Alex Herrera up again with two on, and he goes oppo down the right field line. Both runs come in to score, and it's a two-run game. Linden has the tying run at the plate now, and this looks like it's going to find the grass, but there's Luper Seal with a diving catch to end the inning and keep it 10 to 8. Top seven, the Huskies add on. Robert McDaniel drives in two with a single to center. Houston would get four in the inning and they go on to win 14 to eight. Seven of the 12 Husky RBIs belong to freshmen. 